So I recently did a gig where there was a backstage and it's quite a privilege to have a backstage at a gig, you know, but we're not talking here the mirror with the light bulbs around it. We're talking like a cupboard to put your gear in, which is okay usually, but this gig had 10 other bands on the bill. So as you can imagine, that cupboard got pretty full pretty quickly. And the polite thing to do is to stick around, watch the other bands, appreciate them, chat to people around, but it leaves you with a dilemma because band number 10, they're on their last number. What do you do? What do you do? And what do the other nine bands do as well? Now, here's the thing. This is what usually happens. The mad rush. Who's ever experienced the mad rush? So what happens is, do we let each other go one at a time, band at a time? No, of course not. We all go in at once <laughs> to grab our stuff and suddenly you have to have the poise of a ballerina to get all over this stuff. You have to have like the hands of a praying mantis to grab what you need. <laughs> so let me know, have you ever experienced the mad rush where you're just all in one room like, excuse me, mate, oh, sorry, man. Oh, sorry, excuse me. Oh, I'll just grab this. I just gotta get to my thing here. Ah, no, 